What's up guys, it's John Reeves Live, and today we're going to be checking out a reaction that I just did on our Twitch channel. If you guys would ever like to watch one of our live streams where we do live reactions, there is a link to my Twitch in the description below. We're able to do the reactions over there without getting pulled off of YouTube. But in saying that, if y'all are new to my channel, please smash that sub button and let's do this. 3, 2, 1, BOOM! Yeah. And the song is called Zen. And this is a live performance. Grab on your pants, people. Let's do this together. Boom! By the way, live, she she is five foot two, maybe. Oh my god. So she's a really not tall person, but like live a shorter than me. <laughs> she controls the crowd, dude. And That's like cool. does such a good job. Such <clears throat> a good job live. So here we go. Let's freaking do it. Boom. I already love it. Crowds in Japan are built different too, man. She's got a great screen too. Dang! Oh, I love the drummer too. Look at how she's playing, man. Yeah. I wish they'd show the crowd some too because they probably yeah. I gotta say something really quick. Gotta throw this out there really quick. Two whole seconds. But the fact that like <clears throat> this reminds me the the way that the drummer's playing reminds me a lot of like drumline. You know, like the freaking just like the kind of fierceness that mm. drumline has a lot of the time. Yeah. I love that man. I freaking love that. And then like again, just for how small she is, she's just like got a presence. So one thing I've noticed about you can a lot of times you can tell which drummers are classically trained from mm -hmm. drumline yeah, yeah, in yeah. bands by mm -hmm. the way that their drums are yeah, set up. Yeah. So like if they're set up more flat, mm -hmm. then they're Definitely probably classically drumline. trained. Yeah, yeah. If they're like makes angled, a lot of sense. then they're probably not. Yeah, that's true. Dang though, dude, this song is so freaking heavy. She's doing a lot of really cool screams too. This song does not let up, dude. I love the fire. That's real fire, ain't it? Yeah. Fire. That is so heavy. I just love how, like... Yeah. God. And their guitarists are so good, man. She's freaking awesome live. I love that. That's some straight up Pantera. Yeah. This song has a southern feel to it. That's yeah. wild. We're talking about that screen. Okay, the scream she just did right there, she just went from like this really like low to like a high scream and just like, I love the way that she built into that and just threw it out, man. That was so freaking good, dude. She's got a great scream. They're shredding on seven strings. That's cool. Oh yes, dude! Man, she looks so intense. I wish the dude. Oh, 
<laughs> Damn. Threw yourself all the way back. Hey. Yeah. <laughs> I love the echo. Uh, I got. I got to say something. People might like disagree with me on this, but I have to say one thing really quick. And if it gets some hate, it gets some hate. I'm sorry, but I have to say this: the cameraman on some of these lives that I've seen has been doing them a solid injustice, dude. Because there's so many things that they're like synchronizing in. Like for instance, that one part right here, right, right here, right there. Yeah, it should have stayed on this. Maybe even there, but they're. They should have stayed on some of these things because there's so many parts where, like, they synchronize in doing things, mm -hmm. and it looks so cool from that perspective. Like, you're like, holy crap, it yeah. looks awesome. And so you really don't get a full effect of, like, that song. There's another song called a Hypnosis or Hypnotic that, like, you don't get that same feel from it because you're not really seeing the full picture. Mm -hmm. But the full picture is awesome. Yeah. It'd be like seeing the Mona Lisa, and you're just seeing her smile. And either way, Nima Phila, man. Hit me with your thoughts on it. I love that one, dude. Her scream, like, the way that it, her highs, it sort of reminded mm -hmm. me a little bit of Corey Taylor from Slipknot. Oh, like, yeah. Like, when I, she was going fast yeah, with the, yeah, yeah. the words a little mm -hmm. bit. Yeah. But dude, I love that. Just means you got to see him live. Yeah, That was straight up, like, freaking uh, metalcore. Yeah, Like, definitely. 2010 era. Yeah, and that freaking pause where it just goes straight into the guitar riff, I was like, mm good yeah. i like it <laughs> like yeah. the one where it was like and it was a break yeah. and then it was just the guitar building up Man, yeah dude was, so yeah. freaking good <laughs> but yes it's definitely they're a great band to check out live because in my personal opinion this is just me and i'm sure a lot of people are gonna be like dude shut up but their live videos they're just not doing them justice man because there's so much coolness that is going on in the live concert that they're like there's so many choreographed things that are happening and i'm like dang yeah. stop panning away from it yeah it's like with bts stuff there's so many times where people have been like the freaking cameraman sucks here you know i don't know guys talk about a clean vocals too look i will say they didn't really have a whole lot of clean vocals here but when they did that come part in, i noticed that part slap that slap part was it. very good very freaking good man because it was kind of just like a couple of lines yeah. maybe but it was like she repeated them yeah. and was like mm -hmm. going up kind of yeah it was very good and i also wanted to say this to anybody out there that's like this is not my cup of tea they're maybe way too heavy for me and they're just screaming a lot or something like that they do a lot of songs where she sings the equivalent to how much she just screamed right there so like and she's got a very very powerful voice what i love about her clean voice is she's got like in the cleans that you heard there didn't have any rasp in mm -hmm. it it was just really clear really yeah. beautiful cleans she's capable of doing those but and i think that this goes for a lot of metal vocalists out there you can either have a really good clean and then have a scream and including like if you think about like um my first story we just listened to really good clean he also does a really good scream but you don't hear a lot of a, like a rasp a raspiness mm -hmm. she's got a very powerful when you said Corey taylor like he's probably in my opinion one of the kings of like raspy not quite yelling not quite singing he's yeah. kind of that in between <clears throat> and she crushes that as well too okay. like that those those in between moments mm, she freaking crushes it dude and guys thank you very much for checking this video out i am away currently right now at tokyo or in tokyo i guess for a travel vlog and i just want to say thank you very much to our patreon for helping support me and getting me over there honestly there would be no way that i would be able to do any of these travel vlogs without you guys and i really wanted to say thank you from the bottom of my heart if you guys do want to help support the channel there is a link to our patreon in the description below hope y'all having a blessed day or night whatever time you're watching this spread some positivity out there be kind to each other and if anybody needs anything at all all of my socials are at john reeves live send me a message and i'll catch y'all next time freaking toodles